Hi, I'm Tony Fleming and welcome to Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Today, we are following this character, Mr. Budman, out here to this beautiful 1967 427 Tri Power Corvette. What you think so far, Rich? What? I said, what you think so far? These are not the thing. I love the car. How do you not love the 427 Corvette? 435 drive power, four speed. Let's go. Let's hop in and go for a ride. Alright, here we go. 427. So what you think so far, Rich? I love this car. Convertible. It's great convertible weather. Numbers matching. I mean, you know, this is the pinnacle of the Corvette. I mean, listen to it. It sounds amazing. So, let's see. And away here we go. Everybody's thinking Corvettes are a dime a dozen. They really are not. 67 is the last year for this car, and then they went to the C3. 427, 435, big block, tri power, four speed. Come on. Do I really need to say it? It's like going into a supermodel convention and you've got Christy Brinkley and some unknown girl. Who are you going to pick? I know I'm picking Christy Brinkley. This is Christy Brinkley. Definitely Christy Brinkley before and after Billy Joel. <laughs> I mean, listen to the sound of this car. Midpipe knockoffs, numbers matching, four speed, beautifully restored, stinger hood, clockworks. Come on, that's better than anything. See, even he agrees. It's better than anything that's out there right now. <laughs> so me and Mr. Diesel were having a little talking contest. And the guy in the Kia is a little intimidated right now. Sorry there, big shooter. Yeah, well, you know, these things happen. So, you know, we've had this, this car for a short period of time. We've gone through the car like we do with every car. Uh, I mean, the, the fit and finish, believe it or not, is actually beautiful. And I know they didn't come from the factory this way, but with the restoration that was done, uh, I, I mean, you're just not going to beat this car. It's priced, uh, it's priced right in the mid-range of, you know, number one Concorde cars that you just don't drive uh, to the, you know, number three cars that you drive. I would say that we're we're not a one and we're not a two. We're somewhere right between a one and a two on this car, uh, and it shows. You see it in person. I just don't know how to describe it any better than that. Pictures don't do justice. You have to come and look at the car. If this light would ever go green, we'd be able to drive it a little bit. Beep, beep, Mr. Kia.
parked out front. They're gonna bump the Lamborghini, they're gonna bump the AMG Mercedes. You know, this is the car they want out front. It's smooth, it really is smooth. Okay, wait till we get up to the twisties a little I bit know, more. Right? Give a little power into it. Yeah. Take it. 